Hello, in this video, we're going to verify a trigonometric identity. We've got that the cosine of pi over x is equal to negative cosine x. And we're carefully going to go through all the steps to show that this identity is true. Let's work through it. Solution. So first, I'm going to write down a trig identity that we're going to use for this problem. So if you have the cosine of a plus b, this is equal to the following. So easy way to memorize it is it's cosine cosine. So it's cosine A, cosine B. And then you switch the sign. So because there's a plus, you want to put a minus. And then it's sine sine. Sine A, and then sine B. So whenever it's cosine of A plus B, it's cosine cosine which is the sine, sine A, sine B. If it was cosine of A minus B, it's the same, except you just reverse the signs. So instead of a, a plus here, you have a minus. Instead of a minus here, you have a plus. So we have cosine of pi plus x. This is cosine of pi plus x. That's equal to, it'll be cosine of pi times the cosine of x minus, and then it will be a sine of pi, sine of x. I probably should mention it, but obviously a here is pi, and b is x. So it's cosine pi, cosine x, minus sine pi, sine x. And it's pretty easy. It's a, b, a, b. So you just look at it, pi x, pi x. So pretty simple. Now we have to figure out what the cosine of pi is. Well, on the unit circle, cosine is the x coordinate, and sine is the y coordinate. The so pi is this angle over here. So on the unit circle, this ordered pair is negative 1 comma 0. So the x coordinate would be negative 1. So that would be the value of the cosine of pi. It's negative 1 times the cosine of x minus. And then the sine of pi, well, that would be the y coordinate uh, at pi, which you can see from the unit circle is 0. So sine of pi is 0 times, and then we have the sine of x. Really nice. This is equal to, so negative 1 times cosine is negative cosine. And then 0 times sine is sine is 0, so I just won't write it. So that's it. That completes it. I like to finish my little proofs with a little box with an x. Hopefully this has helped you. Hopefully you've learned some mathematics. If you have, um, yeah, just keep watching. Good luck. Take care.